Hey, what is going on YouTube? This is Admin Yellow Ninja Steel Ranger here for the Gold King Ranger page. Today I have another Super Sentai review, this time from Ninja. This is Paun Maru, or as it has just aired in uh, Ninja Steel, the Rumble Tusk Sword. So I thought now would be a good time to take a quick look at this uh, toy. And um, yeah, so here we go. So as always, I will start by taking a quick look at the box. So on the front, obviously, we have a picture of Palmaru, the elephant. Um, we have its two modes. It's shuriken, three modes, I should say. Uh, it's shuriken, what it does in shuriken engine. Uh, on the back, we have, on the side even, we have just another picture of its modes. On the top, we have some kind of action pose. On the top, uh, some Japanese writing I can't read, and a really cool picture of the shuriken. On the other side, another shot of basically what it does in Shurikenjin. On the bottom we don't really have much other than the sword, so yeah. So here is Palmaru. Now this thing is tiny, and I mean tiny. Um, it's, it's not as tiny as the American version, but it is a lot more detailed. So obviously we have the elephant face here, some really nice moulded gold detailing which I do like. Uh, obviously, you can tell where the shuriken is uh, on the back, on the side. Even I don't know why I keep saying back. Some more nice detailing on the back, the tail, and you can clearly see what's about to happen. And on the other side, basically just the same. So to to get the shuriken, you must you have to split this into uh, basically you have to rip it apart. So take off the two back legs, and they become these axes. Take off the front, the front face, and you have the shuriken, so push this head down and you have the actual shuriken. Take this back piece off, and there you go. So we're going to have a quick look at the shuriken sound effects. Um, it's a bit different to the um, standard shuriken because they don't make the same sort of activation noises and stuff. Um, we'll, we'll go ahead and do that. So. Normally, when you uh, unscrew the shuriken, you will get a little clicky noise. But with this, it doesn't do that. So, if I can get it in. You have to press the, uh, the button to do it. It's a bit different. So, anyway. So yeah, that is all the sound effects you're going to get without Shuriken Jin. So as with all the Ninja Steel Shuriken, this does have some connectivity with the Ninja Ichibanto. So if we go ahead and place it in. So not the greatest sounds ever, but you can do that if you want to. So I've gone ahead and brought in my shuriken engine. Now, so if we take off the uh, red shuriken, take off the um, sword from the yellow arm, take out the um, shinobi maru, I almost said red bot, if I can. Hang on a minute. There we go. Now you are ready to go. So, as always, you are going to need a pilot. So take the elephant head and this piece here, stick them together. That's your pilot, basically. Uh, flip the head up that's hiding at the back. And he is ready to go. So you put him in the place of uh, Shinobi Maru. If I can do this, because I've not done it in a while. There we go. Um, obviously you can manoeuvre the handles to fit the hands, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to do that because it takes too much time. 
give him the two axes. So you put them in each hand. Um, Now to do that you have to flip down, there's like some pieces here that you need to flip down, so it's not easy but it is what needs to be done. And once you are able to flip them down, they'll just cover up this, like so. Anyway, so you uh, give him the, uh, the axe, there's one, do the same thing on the other side and he'll have two. So he's pretty much ready to go. Um, now if you take the shuriken, the elephant shuriken, the palmaru, flip the head down, like so, and clip him in the top, you are going to get some sound effects, so here we go. So very different from the um, Americanized version. Obviously this came first and the American version is uh, basically just a redo of this. But it is a very nice toy. Now it's not necessary for the line unless you want to have all the shuriken and you want to have all the, the mechs. Um, it's still quite an affordable price so if you do for some reason want to collect uh, the, the Ninja line and you haven't already and it isn't the hardest thing to do. So, thank you very much for watching. I've been Admin Yellow Ninja Steel Ranger, and I'll see you again soon with another video.